I was sitting on a park bench all alone. Half of my family was in jail. The other ones were struggling or on drugs. And I remember laying on that bench and staring at the sky and deciding that this couldn't be me. If I stay stagnant, then I'm gonna die here. I'm gonna die in this place. And so it was at that moment that I decided that no matter what I had to do, that this wasn't gonna be my reality. I didn't really get a childhood. I was forced to grow up. My father was incarcerated before I could remember. My mother ended up being incarcerated, and so at 11 years old, I was basically on my own. Just trying to find out where my next meal was gonna come from. Where am I gonna take a shower, you know, wash my hair, brush my teeth? Health and wealth are intricately connected. When people don't have financial security, they cannot prioritize their health. They're prioritizing survival. Diabetes that is constantly out of control, hypertension that is out of control, are downstream consequences of upstream causes such as low income, lack of housing, inability to afford food. Health equity means that everyone has the ability to be healthy and to thrive Boston Medical Center has something called a Health Equity Accelerator. Its vision is to provide health justice by eliminating and narrowing disparity gaps. Boston Medical Center focuses on altering people's life course trajectory by enabling them not to need charity. When I found that I was pregnant, I was 19 years old. I never wanted my son to experience what being hungry feels like being out in the streets alone with no one. The pediatrics department at Boston Medical Center is really first in the nation in leading the way in health equity for children through a variety of pioneering programs over the last several decades. The patient navigators were created because it was just so evident to us in seeing our patients in clinic every day that there were outside factors, other factors besides their health care, that really were determinants of health. The navigators will work with the medical team to address things like housing, transportation, access to childcare, anything that actually impacts the family and impacts their ability to be healthy or to get good health care. What I hope to see is children getting into school and doing well, breaking generational cycles of poverty. And we're already seeing some of our parents becoming navigators, helping other families. Boston Medical Center took a chance with me in giving me the opportunity to become a housing navigator. The only credentials I have was lived experience. Hi, how are you? Being able to help family members and patients in the same predicament I was helps me feel accomplished because I'm giving back to my community. I now live outside of Boston with my son and my parents. I feel very proud of myself. I now know that everything I went through wasn't in vain. This whole system of healthcare needs to change. At Boston Medical Center Health System, we are rewriting healthcare. Economic mobility paired with clinical excellence is what is going to drive change. And we need like-minded partners because we can't do it alone. Mass Mutual Foundation has been a great partner in enabling us to be able to have sustained impact through focusing on financial security for communities and enabling them to thrive. And so now having my own place, it feels great to know that this is mine and I worked hard for it. I'm the queen bee and no one can get me out of here. You can rewrite your story, reinvent yourself. You can be the change for someone else that you needed.